We have been speaking about faith. Okay, faith in oneself. Given how many times you and I have stumbled and fallen and failed, <laughs> it might seem like quite a proposition. We could qualify it a little bit. Say, we're talking about having faith in God the possible, in the creator within us, within you and within me. Always present. And always a reason to have ultimate faith. Tune into that. I'd like to read from the American poet, Walt Whitman. wrote a poem called Song of Myself, and this is from the beginning. I celebrate myself and sing myself and what I assume you shall assume. For every atom belonging to me as good belongs to you. I celebrate myself. Seems to me the creator's doing, doing that every moment of creation. Celebrating himself, herself. <laughs> celebrating all the essences of creation that are present. That's what we're here to do, I believe. That is what's true for me. I'd like to consider with you the significance of what we do in manifest form on earth. That is what we express of ourselves into the world, what we put out there in any way, whether on the hand pan, speaking, singing, working, creating whatever, having a conversation. What is the significance of what we manifest? What we manifest in expression has often clear practical implications. You need to balance your checkbook, cook breakfast, do whatever it is. So there's clear implications in terms of the practical world, but something else happens too, because there's a relationship between what we express and embody in action in our worlds and the energy field that we create. Is there not? I am sure we've all noticed that. Whether it's going for a hike, singing a song, playing the piano or cello, whatever it is, that activity creates a field and therefore an experience that was not there before. Yes. It, it does if we're doing it right. I suppose if we're doing it with some kind of malice or complaint, that creates a field of its own kind, an energy of its own kind. But I'm talking about creative expression. It creates a field. A field of energy. And that field of energy connects us to power. Things are possible with that field of energy that weren't possible before. We, we even come to know things we didn't know before because of that field of energy. You ever notice that? I noticed it, no, notice it. And then I've noticed it specifically about us as a community of people. <laughs> 